What up, Transformer fans? This is BAS1994 here with the review of my Transformers Decepticon Warship, The Victory. Now, basically, I did this completely on the cartoon from the Generation 1, because this is where you can only see it. Except for the thrusters, I kind of basically just did these like a shuttle, so you could see. See, they're supposed to be like three in the middle, but I thought, eh, what? No, that's not gonna work for this size. Anyway, eh. As you can see, I did the, like, almost like the cartoon, like, basically, I think I did the cockpit right, because if you look right here, you could, oh, sorry. If you look right here, very closely, I yeah, you can see the cockpit, like, right here where my finger is. Finger is, and then I added the Decepticon symbol from my Creo star screen right there. The show. <coughs> then, like, I added these two things here. I think engines from the warship. And then I added those two lasers. Yeah, the lasers, the show the lasers, because I think it had lasers. Anyway. Now for a length and size comparison time. And what better ship to do it with than my tri than the first warship that brought Megatron to Earth. The Nemesis. Now. I did the... Now, I know I... T now, I know I told you that I took the Nemesis. I took some parts from a few of my old Legos and put them together. This one I just simply put entire made entirely out of the scrap Legos and a few ships that I had. Now if you do a length comparison now if you do a length comparison you can see that hang on um, let me just get this right yeah, you can see that the Nemesis is about a few inches, probably right off the top, smaller than the Nemesis. Now, for a height comparison, see how tall it would be when the Nemesis is standing up like this. He's right there. I gotta hold him. Again, the wingspan is about yeah, a little bit. Nemesis is about a little bit longer than the Nemesis, but still. Ooh, gotta fix that for the Nemesis. Anyway, like. Also, I sort of. Well, also like. I did also, like, um, I'm trying to think, sorry. Oh, yeah. I also, like, added a few features of my own, like, I didn't know how the fin would go down here, so I basically made the back look like an ordinary human rocket. Now, if you, and basically, ooh, sometimes, if I get the right form, like, sometimes if it wasn't on a table like this, like, say, a hard surface, it could stand up on its own. And like the jets I took from the Imperial warship, the Imperial destroyer, that broke a few years back. But anyway, that's it. The Autobots may need the fear and cower for the trans for my Transformers Lego Victory Warship. Please subscribe, like and and enjoy this video and please stay tuned for more